Hey guys, this is Misa and in this video, I'm going to show you how to build your own affiliate chatbot using ManyChat, how to get people inside your bot and send them messages with affiliate links. So we go to Growth Tools, Widgets, click New Growth Tool. These are embeddable widgets for your website. So if you have a website and you want to drive your website visitors to your messenger bot, then you can play around with these widgets. They are super easy and you don't even need any coding skills. Currently, I don't have a website, so I like to use the other growth tools. Um, I use the landing page growth tool and the ref URL growth tool. Both are super easy and you can set it up in less than two minutes. So most of the times, almost every time I use the ref URL, this creates a simple link that when someone clicks on it, they automatically get subscribed to your messenger bot. Um, I'm gonna show you how this works. The opt-in message is what people will see when they click your link and are taken to messenger. So we're gonna go ahead and edit this message. This is, by the way, the default message. Let's say, for example, I am giving away an affiliate marketing 101 guide and a few people click the link. So now I'll send them the guide inside of Messenger. So I will create or I will write my opt-in message something like this. It's really important that um, you give a choice to your subscribers so that they can easily unsubscribe. Um, because if you don't, if they don't know how to stop receiving messages from you they're either going to report your bot or block your conversation and this can be really bad in front of facebook and they can shut down your page so you don't want to do that and then i'm going to use this file option to upload the guide so they can easily download the file um, once i'm done i'm going to go ahead and click publish don't forget to click publish because if you do not um, publish your edited message then um, it won't be saved and uh, your subscribers are going to see default um, message so always remember to publish the edited opt-in message and then if I want to send them follow-up messages I will add them to a sequence um, I'm gonna show you how to um, create messages in a sequence in a moment then you click next and then click save and voila here's your ref url and then all you have to do is copy the url and then you can paste it anywhere you want so people can click the link and subscribe to your messenger bot also if you have a lot of ref url um, messenger links and um, you know it can be hard to remember which link is for what so you can actually edit this link so you can remember what um, what is this link used for? So I'm just going to write it down affiliate marketing 101. And I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to click save. There you go. So the ref URL was edited. And now it's easy to identify and remember what this link is actually used for. Now, let me show you how to create sequences. For that, you have to go to automations click sequences, click on new sequence, give a name to your sequence. So let's just call it demo, create, and then click this button to start your new message. Now here you have to pay close attention or else you can mess up with the Facebook guidelines if you're not paying attention. The first message inside of the sequence should not have any promotional items. Um, so don't be desperate to sell or promote your affiliate links just yet. In this case, what I will do is that since I'm giving away an affiliate marketing guide, I will send them a reminder message. So let's say I'm actually reminding them about the guide that I sent earlier. This is something I will say Hey, first name, I hope you read my Affiliate Marketing 101 guide where I show you blah, blah, blah. And then I'm gonna go ahead and publish. Then I'll schedule the message to be sent after an hour, um, after somebody opted in. 
this actually depends on how short or how long your guide or whatever you're sending is. So if it's something that can be read within 15 minutes or an hour, then um, you want to send them um, the reminder message as quickly as possible. And then I'm just gonna turn this reminder message on. I'll then create another message and here's where I'll um, try to promote my affiliate offers. So let's say I want to send them to a free webinar. So this is an example of how I will do this. Um, first of all, I'm just gonna um, say something like good news for you, first name, and then add an emoji. To add an emoji, you just have to click this smiley face here. And then I go ahead and uh, add the GIF. Um, you can use that by clicking on this image button and then you can upload um, the GIF you want to use. And then afterwards, I'm going to send them a message. Um, my friend Scott is doing a free webinar where he will be teaching the exact strategy of how he made um, $15,000 in 30 days with just one product. By the way, this is not true. <laughs> I just made it up, but anyways. Um, and then you say, click the button below to sign up for the free webinar. And then in, um, inside the button, you will redirect them to our website. And then um, the website address, you're gonna put your affiliate link um, so that they can go and register and you get the credit for it. And then you press done, click publish. Um, and then I'll probably, um, schedule this message to two days. Turn it on. And then the rest of the messages, I'll just try and give them some valuable tips and hacks on affiliate marketing because um, if you always just keep on sending messages with affiliate links, then that's going to be spammy and your subscribers can report um, that to Facebook and this will lead Facebook to shut down your page. So be careful of that and don't spam. Um, send them some valuable messages with tips, hacks, or some case studies just so you can, um, just so they can like you, know you and trust you and they can even buy um, future products from you. Another exciting thing um, with bots are the broadcast and these are one-time messages that you can send to your subscribers. So we go on the new broadcast. So let's say you're doing a Facebook Live on affiliate marketing and you want to let your subscribers know so that they can join you. One thing to remember though is that Facebook has this 24 plus one rule which means that if your subscribers have not interacted with your messenger bot in the last 24 hours, you can send them a message to get them to engage with the bot and then you can still send them one more message so that will come into the plus one window. Um, I know that sounds totally confusing, um, but I'll show you an example so you can understand it better. So this is how I'm going to craft my broadcast message to send to someone who have not interacted with my bot for at least a week or more. Um, I'm going to ask them a simple question in order to get them to interact with my bot by pressing one of these buttons. Um, so here's the scenario. Hi, first name. I'm going to talk about affiliate marketing and the types of products to promote tomorrow on Facebook at 8 p.m. EST. Do you want to join me? Now, if they click yes, they're basically, if they click any of these buttons, they're basically interacting. So if they click yes, perfect. Please RSVP below and I'll remind you 15 minutes before I go live. So you can be ready to join me and other people wanting to learn everything about affiliate marketing. And then I'm going to um, give them instruction that they have to RSVP now. So um, once they click this button, um, I'm going to know they want to join me. And then if they click no, I'm going to send them, okay, no worries, have a great day. Also for those people who say yes, you want to tag that because um, if you're sending them reminder messages before 15 minutes before you actually do the event or go live, whatever, you want to tag them so that you can send them those reminder messages. So you can say something like, clicked yes to um, live, Facebook live. 
And then you want to go ahead and click on Go Next. Um, click on Subscription Broadcast. The targeting place a condition, so I'm going to go to opt it into Grow Tool 49. It's always a good idea to rename the Grow Tool, just so you know. So I, I'll go back and I'm going to rename this as Affiliate Marketing 101 Guide. You can start sending them the broadcast message now or you can schedule it for later. Just write in the date you want the message to be sent. And then the time zone settings. Um, if you want them to receive the message all at the same time, you can select the send um, all at the same time. Um, if you want them to receive it only during the daytime, so use time travel and um, limit, limit sending time. I don't really use that. I just use um, time travel or um, if I know all my users, all, all my subscribers are from one country, then I'm just going to say send all at the same time. Notification settings, if you have a lot of message inside your broadcast message, then I'll go for only one regular notification because you don't want to annoy your subscribers by, you know, their phone ringing all the time. But if you only have one message in your broadcast, like how I crafted my message, then um, just go for regular push. Once you have completed all the settings, click on send now. Um, the reason why um, this is not clickable right now, it's because I don't have anyone to send this message to. But as soon as you have subscribers in your messenger bot, then um, and you, and you are targeting the right people, then this one will be clickable. So you just click send now and the message will be sent. If you are just getting started with affiliate marketing and are searching for high paying offers, or maybe you are good at affiliate marketing and are on a lookout for more popular products, then you may be interested in my free best affiliate cheat sheet. Um, this is a spreadsheet with over 50 plus high recurring commissions and high ticket offers that you can start promoting right away. This offers, they require no starting cost. So if you have a $0 budget, you can get started and make money. I dropped the link below in the description. So make sure you do check it out. So that is all for today. Um, if you have any questions regarding to messenger bot or any question regarding to this video, please drop them below. And if you have any suggestions on more videos on ManyChat or Messenger bots in general, just drop them below. And thank you so much for watching.